Hello, YouTube! My name is LegoCrop75. Today, I'm having another Let's Play of Fallout New Vegas. Uh, so, yeah, and this Let's Play is on the hardest difficulty on hardcore mode for extra challenge and extra fun. Also, probably talking a little bit quieter today. Well, right now it's not daytime, but it's 11 p.m., so I'm just going to be shooting this video right before going to bed. Uh, I've been having a great day today. Frickin' went to my first ever Pride Parade, kinda. It's just a block party in the final hour of it, too, before everything was shut down. Not shut down, but like, you know, wrapped up for the day. So, oh well. Still fun, though, so. At least I got to enjoy that. Let's see. So when last left off, we were taking care of business. And selling our goods from the free supplies here provided by the Legion themselves. Very nice of them. Very nice. It's what you get for being in the good deeds. Or good. good uh, how do you say it? I don't know. Good grace of the Legion. There we go. The, the store is currently unavailable due to unexpected circumstances. Please come back later. Welcome, sir or madam. Alrighty. Do you wish to purchase something? <laughs> yes. I am ready to process our transaction. Fantastic. And you have full money. Thank God. Sell all the bullets. Right, 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 right. I remember now what we were doing. We were going to be doing Vault 22, but in order to do that properly, I needed to get my hands. Come back. On a C4 charge. Ooh, got something good for me? Is it a dress? What? Why am I so heavy right now? Is it because of... Yeah, it's definitely because of the... I think. Oh, right, yeah. 54 Stealth Boys. I'm just gonna sell those, because I don't need 54 Welcome, of them. Sir, or... I forgot I got 54 Stealth Boys. Oh my lord. Oh yeah, and 15 doctor's packs. I I need 5 cuz I can buy those. There. That's That is better. There we go. Come back and see us again soon. You betcha, fancy robot man. Alrighty. Oh, let me check the vendor for... Welcome, sir. Shush. Oh, I would love to get my hands on combat armor right now. With us getting so close to being able to acquire... Um, fucking power armor. It's like, why even bother? So sadly, no detonator yet. Let's see. Yangtze Memorial. No, I don't think we're going to find anything there. I, yeah, I have no idea. Let me go back to uh, Novak and do this properly. Oh, do you? Hey there. Need anything? That there. Sure. Here's what I got. Never mind. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, this might be a challenge. I might have to do a different vault altogether in the meantime. We'll have to see. There we go. You're 
making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Got all the good ammo going. There we go. I think that should be correct. Yeah, might as well. Sweet. Alrighty. Oh, that of water. Huh. Alrighty. I guess I'll just have the good springs real quick and just drink water. <laughs> Trouble. Oh hi. Sweet, free XP. Too bad I can't make purified water here. Hold on, am I recording? Okay, good, I'm recording. You know, when I start, when I was about to just start recording and shit, I saw my mic wasn't transmitting, which is like, oh dear, you know? Because I made that mistake. You know, with the uh, Bioshock Let's Play. Thankfully not the main one, just the um, Minerva's Den, so not as big of a deal as it could have been. But like, it still sucks, because like, well damn. That's like part of that recording, just not there anymore because of that. Uh, let's see. I'm hoping... That whatever it is I'm looking for... Is here. Otherwise, I'll have to look it up. And try and figure it out, because... The easy way to do this is going to be doing it this way. Otherwise, we're going to have to hope that the long fuse dynamite Always works. Always nice to have a friend of the inst. Uh, no. <sighs> yeah, you don't really come to. Oh, what the hell? T45 power armor. Just straight up. Both full condition and broken condition. That is crazy. Yeah, help just buy some food off of them. Yeah. Also, stim packs. Yeah. Give me a shot if you need anything else. Sure. Bye. Bye. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna have to look this shit up again, because, like, I really don't know where the hell this is. Yeah, I'll just talk more about, about my day while I'm looking this up. So I went to my first ever Pride Parade. I, they had a bunch of cool tents there. Even though it was, like, the last hour of the event, it was like, they still had shit going on. It was fantastic. Um, detonator. Let's see. Yeah. My favorite part was the fact that there was like a booth for aid awareness, AIDS awareness, and they had a little thing set up where you could just toss dildos through a hole <laughs> for fun. I'm like, this is the best hey. place ever. I'm like, just tossing dildos through holes. What could be more fun than that? <laughs> that was fantastic. Um... Oh, no. Ranger Milo. Okay. Actually, I think we can do this. I was hoping to avoid talking to this guy yet, but... Desperate times call for desperate measures. There we go. 
says we can find one over here, so we're gonna do that real quick. But yeah, that was a great time. Also, there was this one lady who was really vibing with the music and was starting to just take her titties out. And she was making extreme eye contact with me. I was like, this is awesome. I was really enjoying this. I didn't know if she wanted me to come closer, just watch. I was so confused. Because, like, sure, if she wanted me, I would love to just partake of whatever she wanted. But at the same time, it's like, I don't know. And it's just one of those things where it's like, I don't want to fuck up and just make a scene or just do something just stupid and just cause an issue. I'm like, that's the last thing I want to do right now in such a sacred place, if you will. So I just watched, gave her a nice smile, and carried on. It's, it's all you can do sometimes. Hey, Milo. Hold up there. This area is locked down by the NCR military until we can dislodge some Legion snakes from Nelson. My name's Best Mailman. Oh, heck. I've heard of you. Supposed to be a regular hero or something, ain't that right? But maybe you're a little too reputable to get involved in some dirty work for the Republic. Are you interested in cracking jokes or getting something done? <laughs> well, I'll be damned. Looks like you've got some dirt in you after all. If you had a few dozen doses of Psycho on you, maybe we could pep those weepy troopers into charging down into Nelson and taking back the camp. But since that's not likely, you could help me take out the Legion's trooper hostages. I'm a ranger. They're troopers. Different branches. I don't have authority over them, even though they're as green as a super mutant's backside. Besides, they'd probably start crying as soon as they saw the hostages get so much as a bruise. Nope, they don't got the stomach for it. The troopers won't go down in the camp with their comrades at risk. Dirty game the Legion likes to roll out whenever they get a chance. Problem is, Ranger Milo doesn't want to play. If we take out the hostages, they've got squat for leverage. Back at Ranger School, they taught us not to run headlong into a battle when you're outnumbered 10 to 1. You want to go down there and try to haul those crippled boys off those poles? You're dumber than you look. That's a shame. Well, let me know if you change your mind, or those Legion sons of bitches will be holed up in Nelson for weeks. Hey, hold on. Just so you know, if you go down into that camp, one of two things is gonna happen. Either that little head of yours is gonna sail into the Colorado courtesy of a Legion machete, or they're gonna try to make friends with you. And if I find out you're friends with the Legion, I'll put a lump of lead through your skull as soon as you pop it back up over the ridge. Are we clear? <laughs> You've got five seconds to get out of my sight before I show that rifle where the sun don't shine. I think it's time to knock you down a peg or two, Ranger. Understood. Much obliged. I'm not here to make enemies yet. However, you there are defying Even. the laws of physics. <gasps> what? It's for free? Wow, okay. Well, that solves my issues. What the fuck? It's just there for free. That's feckin' fantastic. Feckin' fantastic. Alright. Oh, wait, before I do. Missiles! On me! <laughs> Destiny 2 reference. Oh yeah, as I'm talking right now, the final DLC and final everything for... Alrighty. The sun is killing me. That's sad. Well, yeah, no, the final DLC expansion for Destiny 2 is now out. And honestly, I'm a little tempted to try it out. A couple issues I've been having with the game. Mostly just with the leadership issues from Bungie's side of things. Not the people who make the game, but the people who are the real top dogs. High in this chain of command and all that fuck shit. You know, I don't like them, and I don't want to support their game, because it means it supports them, and I just 
really feel strongly about that. I really do. You know, so... Honestly, it's one of those things where it's like, if I hear enough people say, dude, this game is amazing, you've got to play it, then I'll probably play it, you know? Try it out again. Give it another shot, you know? Something like that. But as far as I'm aware, I'm just going to finish playing Fallout New Vegas. Welcome, sir, or ma'am. And then once I'm done, I might give it a never thought, you know? Until then, the game's dead to me. And I have a million better things to do, aside from play that game. Like, make content for YouTube. Alright, that should be... Yeah, honestly, I'm just gonna sell that too. And we can get rid of this. Yay. Oh, the radiation suit, obviously. Yeah, we don't need that. Sweet. Come back and see us again soon. That means... Alright, I did buy some water, didn't I? chosen one. I, I gotta be honest, that guy, that mercenary there looked a lot like the chosen one. Or not the chosen one, the um, vault dweller from the Fallout Brotherhood of Steel game. The bad one on console exclusive. Really looked like it. Alright, now let's get ourselves some goddamn motherfucking power armor. Hopefully we can get this shit done quick. Hopefully. Let's see. I think... cells even though it doesn't take energy cells. Did was the 
guaranteed way to get to it. Because it's in the oxygen recycling, but in order to get to it, you have to go that way to get to it. And here they are. HEPA 20 cartridge filters. find the uh, ye old ghoul doctor and uh, rescue her from her imprisonment of uh, mantises. Hey! That's enough of that. Over here. For the brotherhood! Minus 82. Okay, let's see. Three. Got my eyes peeled. Got my eyes peeled. Nice. <clears throat> hmm. Still looking. Let's see, he's probably up here somewhere. Hmm. Well, now I'm in danger. What the hell is going on? Still looking. Oh, let's go to a different level. So confused right now. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's funny. Alrighty. Let's see. Oh, science. Ah, I see. Mm, yes. Mm. Damn it. can't get the thing now for science. That sucks. Hmm. What can I get for level 18 now? Loving anatomy would be great. If 
the Aspetapolis is going to be pretty good. Adamantium, good there. Armor really helps with Adamantium, so it's no need. Tag. Right. What would I want to tag, though? That's the real question. I need level 18 perks. get another point into um, agility yeah because then if I do that then I can you know bump that up one point and then hopefully get the rapid reload perk which would be very helpful to have weapons reload really slowly in this game and it really sucks um, so let's see I got the enhan enhanced perception too as well so oh man yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm kind of locked in here. Let me... Now that saves it. Let me load the prior save. stats. So let's see, perks. I have the agility implant. Do I have the perception implant? Let me see something real quick, because if there's any, if there's no speech checks that require a level 8 or 8 perception for a check, I might just get, remove myself perception and add agility to uh, to my account. Perception checks. Let's see. perception you need is seven. Okay. Okay, interesting. Right, so 
I do have the option. So there are some speech checks that do require eight perception. However, some of that stuff can very easily be increased with chems. Honestly, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna, let's see. Cause I'm at two agility. Man. Why am I at a plus sign for strength? Oh, right, okay. Robin stick, plus one strength, gotcha. Okay. Um, man, I really didn't mean to leave this into the video, but uh, sometimes you just gotta really think about perk selection. right now. I'm so conflicted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really conflicted on what I wanted to get done. Because, like, having no agility really screwed me. Like, egregiously so. Side another time, honestly. Yeah. This now I know where the enemies are because I found them. So I was kind of hoping to get these bolts done in this episode. That just did not happen. Got my eyes peeled. Shit just takes way too long. Still looking. There we go. Well, we'll definitely get science up. If anything, we'll try and find some more skill books in the meantime to get science that last few points up just to have that done um, not for perk selection That's basically the equivalent of a level up. The tag perk right there. Actually, no fast metabolism. 
Nice. Alright, let's do this. So I need to slap this bad boy down, yeah. Careful. Someone could trip on that. Uh-huh. I do believe that's all we need to do for that. We'll test it later. Damn, it's, it's just the background talking is really bothering me. Oh, well, it is what it is. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, indeed, but we are well equipped to handle the uh-oh. I've had worse. My favorite part is about these spore plants is that they aren't, like, hey. they're just sitting on the floor. It means we knock back. If I knock back, they will fly back. I've had worse. The NCR sent you. Oh, she's such a dear. Not like that pompous little pedant she works for. But that's neither here nor there. These plants have gotten completely out of control. I've got a plan to deal with them, but I'll need your help. Good. Meet me on the second level, and I'll explain what needs to be done. All right, let's get this done. What's this? Did you do these repairs? Not bad. Not bad at all. Saves me time, I guess. See you upstairs. Okay, I hope she actually just goes upstairs. And I don't have to wait for her forever because she just didn't cycle properly. fault they were experimenting heavily with um, with vegetation and such to the point where it got out of hand and just started making everyone grow into plant people So that's why we're trying to destroy this research, because this is bad. But 
please don't tell me she's here. Okay, good, she's somewhere. Um... Where is she? Counts as both an energy weapon and rifle grip gun. That's amazing. Oh, please tell me she did not go this way. Something was fishy once I realized she didn't actually. Oh, there she is. Okay, good, I just went the wrong direction. It's totally fine with me. I'll take those. Good, you're here. Ready to begin? Yes. Time is of the essence, so I'll be brief. This place is filled with spores that are toxic to humans, and we need to get rid of them. Gotcha. I've pumped the vault full of a highly flammable gas that, once ignited, should destroy the vast majority of spores. There's one problem, though. The gas becomes semi-inert on exposure to oxygen, meaning the gas will have to be ignited close to where it's being introduced. I need you to find the vents where the gas is being pumped and ignite it. Oh, and survive the resulting blast. Good. Return to me when it's done. Now this would go very poorly or very well, we will find out. I think there is a big book of science though. Oh yeah, on this level you can just you're just basically tempted to where the items are located for the ability to steal. Right there. So very, very sucky wucky. But it is what it is. So I think we're all set, so all we need to do is equip the detonator. Head down to 5th level pest control, hit the save button. And run away. <laughs> oh, that was scary. I just see the flames coming. Thank you, D. Ah, good. You survived. I was beginning to think you hadn't. You'll be pleased to know that the spore should no longer be a problem. Oh, very nice. Now all that's left very is nice. to ensure that none of this ever happens again. The research that led to these abominations must be erased. I've managed to create a connection to the vault's backup system from here. I just have to remotely delete all the files, and we're done here. Indeed. This should only take a minute. Just a few more moments and... It's done. We can rest easy. I've unlocked the door, so you're free to run along now. Although it pains me to say it, I wouldn't have made it out of here without your help. If you're heading back toward McCarran, tell Dr. Williams that she has my thanks as well. Sure thing. Ah, good karma. Always a welcome feeling. Science and where be found. That's okay. Alright. Back on up we go. Let's see, what's the recording at? 45? Alright. Well, I think I'll probably. Let's see, is there anything else up here?
sadly, no. No big book of signs. No nothing. Damn. Oh well. Well, I think I'll call it here for this episode. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I hope to see you in the next one. Um, honestly, I shouldn't have said it so soon. But yeah, next episode I will definitely be able to get the uh, power armor unlocked. And then we'll just go from there doing more quests. But as I said before, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. See you next one. Take care and have a wonderful day.